about you and him. You heard I didn't say anything. Because I'm waiting on him to give his life to Christ first. Amen. If he do that, fine. Now everything can move. Because this is a personal decision. True. So tonight I will allow him to be thinking about it. Because I don't want him to take a decision when he's in a hurry. At least he must have time. Uh, the whole night today. And tomorrow we're going to be here, all of us. So before he leaves here, he will be knowing uh, what is good and what is not good. Do you hear me? Touch your stomach. In Jesus' name! Jesus, Jesus, my name. Amen. Amen. Come, sir. Come. Today I'm leaving you. <laughs> yeah. uh, we are not deciding yet. We are not deciding yet. About this relationship. This lady, she's going to be a pastor. This one. And let's say now God gives you a church. God gives you a church. Imagine you're coming from a service and your husband come back home drunk. <laughs> That's the magic. Jesus, my dear. Supporting your children? Yes, I do. All of them? Yes. Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Uh, my name is Progress Muleya, and um, beside me is Nison Mukuze. We come from Zimbabwe, from Bulawayo, Zimbabwe. Um, the reason why we came here today is that uh, we are planning on getting married. So we were seeking for a confirmation, yes, from God.
Okay, um, when the servant of God was addressing the group outside, uh, he said to me, asked me about my mother. Uh, I said she's in, in uh, she's at home in Baitbridge. Uh, he said that we need to pray for Mama, for her healing, cause she's not well. Uh, that you'd want Mama to see our progress as his children and the issue of high high blood pressure and i can i can confirm that my mom has a problem with high uh, with high blood pressure and sh she hasn't been well for quite for, for quite some time now uh, though she has been getting better when the servant of yeah. god addressed us he just uh, tell me about the, uh, my business he's seeing me running a business i'd like to confirm uh, what the servant of God said to me, because it's true. Uh, during the one-on-one -on -one session, um, the man of God um, asked him if he was serious about marriage. He confirmed that he was serious. And uh, the man of God also spoke about the church, about the ministry, the I would like to confirm, it was also worrying me because this is another issue that I wanted him to, to touch on, the issue of my the ministry in me. <laughs> okay, I'm a, I'm a pastor. He, he, he said yes, I, 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 that's why I'm asking about the issue of the church because I see that you are doing something there. I, I confirmed that I'm, I'm a pastor. And uh, he, uh, he, he told him, that, uh, you know, getting married to a pastor is not easy because he drinks. So the man of God uh, said that if he wants to get married and if he's serious about the issue of marriage, he has to give his life to Christ first and he has to deal with the issue of, of drinking. And uh, he said that the decision is on us. But he wants him to give his life to Christ and will give him the time to to, to do that. Um, he also spoke about, <clears throat> as I was about to ask, because another issue that was worrying me was the issue of sickness, uh, like sort of an attack on my stomach. So as I was about to ask him, he, he just spoke about the, that issue that I see also that you are not well. You have a, uh, pro a, a, a stomach problem, of which I confirmed, uh, and he said that he will pray for me because it is an attack. He said that God wants to use me mightily, and he will pray for me uh, that what God God wants to do with me uh, is established. He said that uh, he is praying that I don't get disappointed um, a second time because I've been disappointed uh, in my first relationship of which it's true I have three children and it, 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 it all ended in disappointment we also say that this man has a good heart and that he has also been disappointment disappointed in his previous uh, relationships he said that he should not do the same like what they've done, like consulting Sangomas about concerning his life and also about his business um, that he has to pray, he has to thank God for a tracking logistics business, uh, something about estates, real estate business, yes. To me, yes, I came here uh, with the reason that they con the men of God, that there is confirmation and also the ministry the church yes that was in me and also the sickness so all the issues that i came here for i thank god because they were confirmed i believe that god uh is still speaking and for me god has spoken he has spoken because i believe he uses his servants to convey messages to us yes we pray I, I, I just want to, I, I just want to, I don't know, I thank God for for the confirmation. Though with the issue, with this issue, he has been given time to give his life to God. Of which I think it's, 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 
it's a good thing. We are in ministry to populate the kingdom of God and the addition will be will be a great thing for 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 me and for God as well. So I, I'm happy. I'm happy. I just want to encourage people uh if you are seeking the mind of God as he has said as prophet has said that it is not we do not get an answers from him but uh we get answers from we be, we have to believe God for the answers. So when I when I was coming here I prayed about all those things and I believe that we have to stay in prayer and believe Jesus Christ for for the answers.